I'm late with the squad. I'm late with the squad. Confidence of God. Welcome to the Beer Dojo. Today, we have Sierra Nevada Pale Ale on deck. I'm excited about this one. I feel like I say that in every single review, but I really am excited. A uh, little background on Sierra Nevada. Our most popular beer, Sierra Nevada Pale, is a delightful interpretation of a classic style. It has a deep amber color and an exceptionally full-bodied, complex character. Generous quantities of premium Cascade hops give the pale ale its fragrant bouquet and spicy flavor. A couple tongue twisters in there. Now, I also read uh, it's, it was actually the first fresh hop ale brewed in the United States, which is really dope. The brewery later introduced Southern Hemisphere, which features wet hops from New Zealand. The Chico Estate Harvest Ale is brewed with organic wet hops and barley grown on the brewery's premises. So this is uh, definitely a family owned and operated company, which I always appreciate. We're gonna get right to this review. I'm excited about this one, it's really cold. Do not have the uh, frosty glass today, but it's all good. Let's get right to it. Nice and crispy right there. All right, let's see what we got here. All right. Right off rip, loving the color. Definitely has a full body color to it. More of like a gold amber, which is what I expected from it. Let's see, nice carbonation. Love the smell. It has a, a very rich aroma to it. And I believe if I'm not mistaken that this pale ale is made with mostly hops, like I just read. Uh, let's see. What is Sierra Nevada Pale Ale made of? Sierra Nevada currently uses water, malt, hops, and yeast for every brew. We will also use malted wheat and rye, oats, various fruit, and more for some of our beers, depending on the beer. Automatically, the aroma smells amazing to me. I've never really had Sierra Nevada in my life, to be honest with you, I've heard it. I know there's uh, multiple different lines of beers in Sierra Nevada. Like I said, I really love that it's family owned and operated. Now this is a 5.6% ABV. I also believe that one of the staples of Sierra Nevada is that just like it says on the can, they used pure ingredients, which is what makes this a unique um, craft beer. So we're gonna get right to the test already, like the smell, love the color, good carbonation, I don't know if it's different, if it's in a can or glass. I have noticed that when we when I've done uh, canned reviews, there's more uh, foam involved with most of them. So let's see what we got. Actually, cheers. <laughs> That's what I should say first. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, this is hoppy. That is hoppy. Now, when I first really started getting into beers, I never really liked a strong hoppy taste. Being from New England over time, trying so many different IPAs and different breweries, it became more of an acquired taste. I'm sorry, not an acquired taste. Uh, I feel like very hoppy beers can be an acquired taste, especially IPAs. But over time, my palate changed. Just like, you know, when you're a kid, like, when I was a child, I absolutely um, despised Brussels sprouts. As I grew older, I now I love Brussels sprouts. So palates can change, and I think that's also something that uh, can happen with beers over time, just as you start to appreciate them more and you start to try all different varieties of beers. You really uh, learn what you like, what you don't like, what you can tolerate. It's, it's all, you know, depends on the individual, so um it can be very subjective honestly love the rich aroma the taste mm. as i said it's hoppy um at first but then it it smoothens out has a nice floralness to it i could tell that it's definitely a quality beer 
you know, ever since I've seen Sierra Nevada, you know, advertisement does do a thing. I've always seen it as kind of like, a, you know, if you were to get um, a grocery item at Trader Joe's or Whole Foods, you would expect to see Sierra Nevada as one of those beers, you know, that they sell. So overall, if I were to rate this beer, let's get right to it. I like it. I really do. It has a nice crisp to it. Well bodied. I'm excited to try their other lines. If this is um, one of their popular ones, I'm, I'm excited to try their other ones. I'm a big fan of when craft beers use um, quality ingredients. And also, like I said, being family owned, that's a beautiful thing, passed down to generations. There's a lot of love put into it, into this. So shout out to Sierra Nevada. Mm. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and give this beer a 7.6. Great ABV, a little bit more on the Higher side, 5.6% than your average beer. I just like it. Overall, it's a, it's a great beer. Would it be my first choice? It wouldn't, uh, but it would be one that could come up on the list. So that is the review. Five, oh, I was about to do 5.6 with the ABV. <laughs> 7.6 is the review. Sierra Nevada Pale Ale Handcrafted Ale. Cheers. Cheers.